Good morning, everybody. It's the Michael Pena Senior Show. Where I'm living my passion one day at a time. Well, this is going to be the first show of what I hope to be many. And um, if you're watching this, you're, you're hopefully going to get to know me through each of these episodes, that these short episodes that I hope was going to help you with your financial needs. My name again is Michael Pena Senior. I'm from Brockton, Massachusetts, and I want to be a financial coach. And I hope you learn about me while we're doing this. And you could decide if you want me to be your coach. Even if you don't want to meet with me or anything, you use these videos to hold yourself accountable. I'm using these even if nobody's watching these. I'm holding these videos to hold myself accountable. I have a huge goal. I want to be able to have my own studio someday. So I can do a show from a studio and I can help people. That's what I want to do. I want to be able to help people with whatever it is they're going through financially. As they say, 78% of people are living paycheck to paycheck. There's a huge need for this. And I want to be the guy that helps you. So with that being said, the first show, I want to get right into it. And I'm going to talk to you about why I'm doing this and who got me really into this. There's three mentors that I'm looking up to right now in... These three guys I'm going to describe them to you is, is, is why I'm doing this. The first one is Dave Ramsey. The second one is Ken Coleman. And the third one is Gary Vaynerchuk. First one, Dave Ramsey. And I'm going to be telling you a lot about myself as we go through these stories. But I work at UPS. Right now it's 3 a.m. in the morning and I'm doing this show. And I'll do this show every day, 3 a.m. before I go to UPS until I'm out of UPS, until I'm done working there. And then maybe I can move the show to the drive time, you know, 5 a.m., 6 a.m., I don't know. But I work at UPS as a loader. So for four to five hours every day, I'm loading trucks. It's mindless. It's um, robotic. And, you know, I'll put my headphones on and I'll usually listen to music. Well, I said, you know what, I got I to gotta do something educational-wise here. So I looked up um, some um, financial radio or whatever, and I found Dave Ramsey's podcast. And it was the best thing right now that's happened to me um, that's propelled me into what I'm doing right now. So Dave Ramsey, if anybody who doesn't know him, he teaches people how to get out of debt. He has a plan. And when I first listened to him right away, I said, this guy's, this guy's talking to me. You know, I do a lot of good things uh, financially for myself, but I was doing a lot of good things all together. I wasn't laser focused. I didn't have any laser focus whatsoever. And Dave Ramsey taught me how to get that laser focus. So we're going to be a lot, using a lot of his principles, a lot of his philosophy. Um, again, these three guys that I'm talking about, I have them on my podcast. Um, you can get them and listen to them. You know, you don't have to just listen to me, but listen to them. All right. So, and the thing that really struck me big about Dave Ramsey, I'm doing all these things right, saying what he's doing, and I'm following his baby steps, which we'll go through. And um, the thing that I felt is I didn't have a big enough shovel. Um, I, again, you know, I pay for my son's college education. I, um, we have a home. I have a, you know, wife, two kids, two cars, and all that good stuff with no payments on the cars, you know, old cars, but, you know, but I didn't have a big shovel. So I said, you know what? I got to get out of this. I got to change my career. And there was a time when I worked at a financial institution and I was working as what they considered a financial planner. And um, I said, you know, maybe I can get back into finances. I don't know. One day, Ken Coleman came on the Dave Ramsey show. And Ken Coleman, basically, he's a career guru. So, again, listen to these guys on podcasts because you'll understand. If you're looking to change your career, if you're looking or if you're not sure what you want to do, Ken Coleman's a guy to listen to. 
And, you know, that was a big part of me saying, I got to find a career that I'm going to be passionate about. And, and right away, that's what he says. He'll ask you those two questions. Ask yourself, what are you passionate about and what do you do best? And I wrote them down and he'll say to write them down. And, um, you know, I, and, and you got to go ask some people that, to be honest with you, about your passions, what you do best. And I, I, I talk to people in my family, people even at the gym or whatever. And um, I work as a sports official. I officiate six, you know, six different sports. So a lot of a lot of it was, you know, I'm passionate about sports and I'm good with finance. I'm passionate about, you know, when I was at the gym, I say I'm passionate about working out. I'm passionate about um, money because we'll, we'll work out. We talk money at the gym. Um, so I'm like, what can I put together with, with financing? And, you know, I loved coaching, absolutely loved coaching in my time, coaching my son and, and being a coach. And so I looked up financial coach and found out there's a space in that area. And, and that this is the, the, the path that I'm taking. And I found it through Ken Coleman. And that just brings me to the last guy, Gary Vanacek. Um, I was talking to my son about different finances and telling him my plans of what I wanted to do. And he said, dad, you should listen to Gary Vanacek. So I, I, I listened to crush it. Um, another, uh, an incredible book. I, I, I downloaded it. I listened to the audio tape in one day, one morning at UPS while I was working. And he is a, a social media guru. He took his, um, in case you don't know about Gary, he, he took his uh, parents' wine business, and that was a $4 million business, turned it into a $60 million business, and Gary right now is uh, estimated to be worth $250 million. And that was through social media, and he teaches his social media his skills. And that's basically some of the stuff that I'm doing here today that I'm going to pass along to you. Um, so real quick, you know, we went through that. I mean, Dave Ramsey, Ken Coleman, and Gary Vanacek. Those are, those are the three guys that we're going to be talking about. Those are the philosophies that I'm going to be using. Those are my mentors right now going forward. So I hope that you get something out of this. Uh, every day I'm going to have something that's going to hopefully teach you and educate you in an area that I've done going through these steps. And I'm breaking things down for you to keep it as simple as possible. Um, if you need somebody to hold you accountable, if you're following Dave Ramsey's steps and you need somebody to hold you accountable, let me be that guy. You hold me accountable for the things that I say. I'm hoping that this is truthful and honest as possible that I can get it. So, um, you know, these are the things that I'm looking at. I hope that you're looking for something like that too. You know, real quick, I'm just going to, uh, close with one of my biggest motivators, um, you know, Bill Parcells, um, a good quote from Bill Parcells today is success is never final, but failure can be. That kind of hits me. Um, so that's it for today. And I hope that you enjoy it and I hope that you will enjoy it. And I hope you get to know me and you want, you, you decide whether you want me to be your financial coach. All right, so that's it for me today. And remember, I'd rather be good than look good.